10 4K monitors for under 400 bucks each. Let's take a look. All right, so if you know my channel and you've watched some of my other videos, you know me. I try to find good stuff for cheap, and I do videos a couple different ways. I do a lot of reviews. You guys have seen all my reviews out there and everything like that, where I get the product in-house, I do a review, and uh, I tell you what I think of it. This is gonna be a little bit different. What I'm gonna do today, and I do this quite a bit, is I'm just gonna go through 10, I actually did some research online. I found 10 monitors that are basically gonna be 4K monitors that usually are really expensive, but these are all gonna be under 400 bucks, and some of them almost by half that much. So these are gonna be good for both PCs and Macs. I'm gonna go through just the model numbers and just give you pricing really quickly because we have 10 to go through. Let's start. The very first one here, if you can check this one out, is the AOC U2790VQ. It's a mouthful. 27 inch, 4K, uh, 3840 by 2160. It's a frameless, the very small bezels on this one. Comes in, you know, 400 people bought it. It's got a 4.3 to 5 on Amazon. I'll have links to all these monitors on Amazon. Great, great reviews and 24707. So it's one of the cheapest ones we've actually, uh, you know, have on the list here. Check it out, 27 inches. Second one that I recommend is the Asus VP28, so you get an extra inch. So it's the VP28 UQG 28 inch monitor. It's UHD 3840 by 2160. This one's only got a one second millisecond, one millisecond response time, so it's very nice. It's got active free sync as well, and that's you know very good in a monitor like this. It's only 271.96. The ratings here is 4.1 out of 5 with 613 people buying it. Third one on our list here is going to be the Acer CB28 2K, and this is a little misleading because it is a 4K. It's 28 inches, 4K 3840 by 2160. It's an IPS screen as well. It's 299.99. Check this one out. Acer, you know, this one again has, you know, a little bit less of a bezel around it, so it's going to look a little bit nicer. It's a silver color as well. But I mean, you can't complain. 28 inches, 4K, you know, it, it, for, for under 300 bucks, great, great price. The next one on the list is the LG 24UD58 B. This one's only a 24 inch monitor, 4K UHD IPS monitor. It does have FreeSync as well. Definitely not the most attractive in the list here. You can kind of check it out. It's a little bit more bulky, but it, you know, it's also 24 inches. People can argue you may not need a full 4K for that. But again, $299.99. There's a lot of uses like video editing and, and, and various things may, where you may want something like that or just saving some space. So check out the LG. It comes from a great name as well and uh, great price. Next one on the list is gonna be the LG 27UL500-W. Let's look at the ratings. 1,263 people bought this and it's got a 4.4 to 5. This one's a 27 inch 4K UHD monitor, 340, 349, 349.99. So a really good price on this. Again, from LG, a really good name. And uh, if you look down here, you know, it's got their free sync and built into it as well. Brightness is around 300 nits or so. So check this one out. You know, you can't complain with this. And uh, you know, what are we talking? Under 400 bucks for 4K, would you ever have thought this was possible? Let's keep moving forward. The next one is gonna be by Philips. It's not the most common name in monitors, but this is kind of their flagship. It's 27 inch 4K UHD IPS, one billion colors they claim. If you look over here as far as the design, it does have a nice design. It's very thin. They call it more bezel-less. It's, it's, it does have a little bit of a bezel, but it's a very nice monitor. This one, if you see at the buying options over here, it's 399, so it's at the top of our budget. But this gets really good reviews too. Um, over 3,318 ratings and uh, 4.4 out of five, so a lot of people like it. So if you're checking this one, you know, if you're in the, you know, if you want a 27, 28 inch, somewhere in that range, 4K, definitely consider this one. Look at the reviews. It's always got good reviews everywhere you look at this one. As we go down the list, let's get into 32 inches. Now this is gonna be the first 32 inch I, I had uh, covered right now. It's a Samsung 32 inch UJ59 4K. It's uh, 3840 by 2160, 60 hertz, four millisecond. So it's not you know, gonna be the, you know, maybe it's not so much for high-end gaming, but at the end of the day, you're getting 32 inches of great space on this 4K. Hook it up to your Mac Mini or MacBook Pro. 369.99 over here, 315 people rated it over a 4.1 out of five. So pretty good monitor, check this one out. And again, Samsung is a great name in the industry. Next one, again, staying with 32 inches is the ViewSonic VX3276-4K-MHD. Huge mouthful, 32 inch, they call it frameless. It's got a little bit of a bezel there, 4K UHD monitor. You can see the design here. It's kind of a black uh, finish on it with a silver stand. Pretty nice looking you know, monitor overall. The top of it's very, very thin. Um, 
HDR10 content support as well. Um, these are going to come in stock. They're kind of out of stock right now, or they're, it's more of a new model. It's 377.31, but look for it to be around in a couple weeks, maybe three weeks or so, August 20th, 2020. But a really good monitor as well. It has a lot of good ratings. Next one is sticking with the 31, 32 inch. This is a 31 and a half inch Asus VA32 UQ. 4K monitor, it does have FreeSync, iCare, DisplayPort, HDMI, HDR10. It is the black version of it. Same thing, silver you know, silver uh, stand and black as far as the monitor is concerned here. Um, they don't have a ton of pictures, but you can see some of the pictures here. Not gonna, again, not gonna be the best monitor maybe for high, high-end gaming, but if you're looking for you know, 31, 32 inch of, of real estate for anything else, really, really good monitor for that. So let's check that one out. Asus, again, 379 you know, flat, you can get it right now. Um, the next one here is going to be the last one in the list. This is going to be the LG 32 inch as well, and this is a, called the LG 32 UD 60 B 4K UHD monitor with AMD FreeSync as well. Again, black, staying with that. It used to be $499, now it's only $349. So, really good price on this 32 inch, you know, 4K. And uh, let's go ahead and take a quick peek at it again. It's not the most attractive, these aren't usually. But they are, you know, fairly nice for what you get. I mean, what you know, some of these LGs that cost a thousand bucks for the 5K look very similar to this. So, not a bad look monitor. And uh, pick one up. If you can believe it, you can get a 32-inch 4K right now for this cost. Would you ever have thought that? I wouldn't. Have, so, what do you think? All right. So, what did you think? Not too bad, huh? The list is quite extensive. I mean, you can't find too many more than this. But there's at least 10 of them out there that I, I would, you know, classify as quality 4K monitors right now. And uh, for the price, you really can't beat it. I mean, when you're talking in the 350s, even 270s and stuff for a 4K monitor, it's amazing. I mean, my, I, my, I have an iMac and it's a 5K and you get kind of spoiled with that when you get a 5K display. That's still probably the best deal in the world because 5K displays are around a thousand bucks now and you can get the whole computer for, you know, not that much more. So, especially if you buy it used, but that's, I digress there. That's a different, different story altogether. These are going to be just monitors, you know, under $400. So put some comments in there if you guys find some better ones out there. And if you guys can just please support my channel and click the like button, it's going to help me out a ton. Um, subscribe if you can. And uh, we'll talk next week or in a couple days. I make a couple videos every week on all different types of products, especially technology. Talk to you soon.